This is 1969 Elizabeth II one dollar coin from Canada. From first glance it looks like an ordinary coin. But expert would know that the coin has irregularity in metal composition. It's an error coin struck on Canadian silver 50 cents planchet. Graded as proof like 65 by PCGS this rare error coin ended up selling for $4,025. Number 5. Another Canadian coin. 1979 Elizabeth II 1 cent struck on a 1979 10 cents. Graded in mint state 64 by NGC. Struck on a 1979 10 cents with full date visible beneath the maple leaves and date on the cent. Very rare multiple denomination mint error and a choice example. It fetched a sum of $4,112.50. Number 4. Here is undated Elizabeth II era dollar from Hong Kong. Approximate date range is 1978 to 1980. Graded in mint state 65 by PCGS. Very rare and peculiar as a genuine double-headed coin, and especially lustrous in this gem condition. It was sold for $4,780. Number 3. Moving on with this 1970 gold Manitoba dollar coin. Off-metal planchet error. According to Heritage Auctions, only six pieces are known of the ten pieces originally struck. Four were melted. On the obverse young, crowned and draped, portrait of Queen Elizabeth facing right. On the reverse flowers with date and value. Sharply struck with highly reflective proof-like fields. A few light marks are noted, most mostly in the right obverse field. This extremely rare example was sold for $11,400. Number 2. This is 1993 Elizabeth II 25 cents mule from Canada. Mule of the obverse of the 1992 125th anniversary 25 cents and the reverse of the caribou design. Highly elusive numismatic pinnacle. In coinage, a mule error refers to a coin that has been struck with dies that were not originally intended to be used together. In other words, it's a coin that features a combination of designs or elements from two different coin dies that were not meant to be paired during the minting process. Mule errors can feature different combinations of designs, denominations, or even countries of origin, and they often become valuable collector's items because of their rarity and the curiosity they generate among coin enthusiasts. This one was sold for $7,800. Number 1. And this is 1969 Elizabeth II 25 cents from Canada. An extremely rare mint error, or mint sport, struck over an English gold sovereign dated 1967 with the original Elizabeth readable above the bust. 7.98 grams. Possibly unique, and a trophy for the collector of sovereigns or mint errors. Graded as MS 65 by PCGS this fully brilliant error quarter ended up selling for $21,150. And there you have it, folks, a captivating exploration of some incredibly rare and valuable Elizabeth II coins from Commonwealth countries. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, so you never miss out on more numismatic adventures. Bye.